the cutting of princess that blouse and here we go this fabric this is the wrong side why this is the right side that is why i folded it in now i'm going to fold it into four parts as you can see this is one two three four now i'm going to leave one inch here for the zipper allowance okay so we go now the bust of this particular uh, blouse is 34 and i'm going to use the bust to cut it out and 34 divided by 2 by 4 sorry by 4 gives me 8.5 so i'm i'm going to start from the shoulder the back which is the shoulder is 14 inches and 14 inches divided by 2 gives me 7 inches so here is my 7 inches 7 inches plus 0 0.5 for the same allowance i have my 7 inches so i'm going to measure from this shoulder to the bust side i'm going to measure 7.5 inches i'm going to make a straight line there 7.5 inches so i connect i'm going to connect this line to this place here here to give me the exact so i'm going to connect this to this bust now that's 8.5 haven't divided by 4 i have my 8.5 here so plus extra 2 inches now for the base now the length of this blouse this blouse is an half length i have 18 inches 18 inches now i'm going to measure the base base i'm going to reduce this bust this is 8.5 from here to here 8.5 i'm going to reduce it by one so here I'm, i will be having 7.5 instead of 8.5 which i have at the bust okay now plus two extra So I'm going to connect this to this and I will also connect this to this. I can use my free hand. Oh. I'm going to give a curve to this. Free hand curve by 0 0.5. The nipple is um, 7.5, so 7.5 divided by 2 gives me 3.8 or so. So I have 0.8. I'm going to add 0.5. So that's where I'm going to do throughout my line so here I have half of the line here shoulder to the bust I have 7.5 so I'm going to from here I'm going to measure 4 inches from the shoulder Four inches that's where I'm going to bring out my and I connect to that 
So now I'm going to cut. Now before that, I'm going to lower from the shoulder here. I'm not reckoning with this, so I will quickly trim it off, this plain aspect. Over here, 0 0.8 inches, that is less than one. Now, the neck, I have three inches. So I connect this to this like this. I connect. So now I will take a tape roll. From here, I'm going to measure 0 0.5. Then also from here, from this line, 0 0.5. So, which we sum, the sum will give me 1 inch. So I'm going to... Reduce by 5. This is where I'm going to connect to this and also this, giving me something like trap. So, something like this. I'm going to cut out. So for the neck, you may be wondering why I don't have but the only thing I can do is to just mark it out, though it's not yet time, but to mark out the the neck. So here I have I will connect that to this end. For the back, 1.5. So, for the front, I will connect. So this will be for the back, Why this is for the front. Front. Let me make it deeper a bit so that it will give me a round shape. Okay, so at the back,
so the end of this same um, video if you like it you can subscribe to my channel for more updates on every aspect of uh, cutting thanks for watching this video bye